bodiless head over here, or bodiless head over here. By the Moving way, bodiless head. All right. Well, I'm gonna start yeah. this. The visage of regret. Recording up, everyone. Eric Watson here, freelance writer, player of games, writer of words, recorder of videos, and a D&D adventure in Baldur's Gate 3. I'm trying to come up with something clever because we just watched the Super Bowl, but I don't have anything. <laughs> Good job. Uh... Someone, someone just mentioned it now. I know. I, Good well, job, I, should I spoil Kansas it? City Taylor should Swift. I spoil it right now? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's watching. This is episode... Everyone, everyone will watch this long after the Super Bowl, so yeah. I'm thinking so. Yeah. This is episode 21. Our uh, Baldur's Gate 3 co-op Let's Play series is old enough to drink in uh, some states of the U.S., that's right. If you enjoy the videos, consider it supporting me via patreon.com slash roguewatson. Joining me, we have... Go to character sheets. Uh, we'll do Chris playing Grumnir, the half-orc hunter ranger. Hello. Raymond playing Vorna, the half-elf... Something. Cur cur I was going to say, currently College of Lore Bard, but I think he's <laughs> literally in the middle of multiclassing right now. I am. Okay. I'm going to do five levels of Bard, two levels of Warlock. Five okay. levels of bard, two levels of warlock. So you would see. Respect... I love. I love that Baldur's Gate allows you to do this because, like, he tried five yeah. bard, two paladin last time, didn't like it. Now it's five. That, bard. That's actually really nice too. I, I, I agree. I like games that just let you respec. I mean, it, maybe with a cost, you know, within there, but I think that's a mean pronounce. Uh, and Heather playing Stoli, the Mephistopheles Tiefling Wild Magic Sorcerer. Happy birthday, Kansas City Taylor Swifts. <laughs> Our return as Alagar the right? Beast, Druid Circle of the Moon. Uh, Druid, we're all level 7, with Raymond as our first multi-classer. Man, oh, Sylvan has got to be, like, pounding his head against the wall that the 49ers lost. Yeah, it's... Mm. Sorry, Sylvan. Man, <laughs> that, that one missed PAT, it really haunted them, too, because that allowed the Chiefs to get that field goal that tied it. At the end of the fourth, where it used to, you know, if, if they had gotten that PAT that ended up being blocked, then they would have had to get the touchdown there to force the overtime. Is, is it bad if I... Or obviously fumbling oh. it with the... <laughs> Sylvan beat me to it. Damn it. Mm. On the Discord, he put a, a gif out to how it feels to be a 49ers fan. Oh, and <laughs> it, it's, yeah. not, it's not great. Yeah. Chiefs back-to-back -back champs, too. That's huge. Is uh, pretty pretty good. You know, it's funny. I think I've got the whole party next to me, but actually, it's all my summons. Oh no, there you are. Okay. <laughs> I'm over yeah. here staring at this vicious visage of regret. It keeps talking. Uh, oh yeah, you're right. Also, there's like random piles of money on the floor, and that feels like a trap. It random. does feel like a trap. It's like a Looney Tunes. Like trap. one gold all over the place. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, trying to follow this trail of gold. <laughs> somewhere all right so what were we doing we we were in that dungeon we for know. so long i haven't had to decide where to go in a long time we're on the path to moonrise towers i know that but i think we're just we're just kind of wandering on the path to the moonrise towers well we're back to okay. like the town the the cursed yeah, town the right yeah yeah that's right moonrise is pretty close and also the waning moon whatever that is is close we were gonna do the toll house punish the wicked which is where we are now. Yeah. Because yeah. so yeah. if we get near Moonrise, that's going to probably trigger like a fucking angel battle thing, which we unleashed last time. I still don't regret that. I'm yeah. the one that released the angel. Oh, there's a fucking... What the fuck yeah. was that? No, there's a giant creature walking around. Where? Upstairs. Shit, can you go up a level? I just saw... Oh, there it is. Somebody Visage of Coins. Garingthong of Thorm. I wonder if that's who's dropping the little piles of coins. Oh, yeah, there it is. I don't know what's got 600 hit points. Oh, there's a visage of guilt up there, too. Okay, so there's some shit going on up here. Oh, oh, Jesus. Yeah. My camera's... Yeah, Wayne it's Helmet, just dropping coin piles curse. of coins behind it. What the fuck? That's A, a cool. cursed keeper of coins. So those coins are cursed. What the hell is going on here? Cursed coins have gathered around the head, increasing health. Alert coin armor. I'm just examining the creature now. Could there be a method of removing the armor without destroying the coins? Turn resistance. What the fuck is this creature? Is it hot? It looks hostile though. Is it red? Oh uh, no, sorry, it's not. It's yellow. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, no, it's yellow. That's upstairs. I don't actually know how to get upstairs. I don't either. I'm just gonna turn on all these torches. This feels like a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> but that's the one. Oh, I see, I, I see some stairs. Although I'm not sure if you can actually go up them. 
That's yeah, you can. dropping all those coins. I hear there's some stairs. Dum, 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 dum. Uh, there's a... There's stairs through this door. Oh, are there? That are not destroyed. Wait, Ray's not with us yet. Visage of Obedience is ahead of us. Oh. Uh, another disconnected head. They're all floating heads. Yeah, do we need to talk to the floating heads? I, want it back. I have a feeling we're going to talk to them at some point. But which head do we talk to? Mm hmm. There's like four of them. Let's have a look. Uh, or do we go up, go up the stairs to the to that creature? I would talk to the this, this school first, but I don't know. Well, there's that one over there, and then there's one on the other side, too. Pick whichever one looks the nicest. Cursed coins. This cursed visage controls part of the coins protecting the toll collector. We gotta talk to all the visages to, before we get to the toll collector. Okay. So no going after that monster until we talk to all the visages. Alright. Well, I'm an owlbear, so I'm not doing the talking. <laughs> <laughs> it says, This visage is floating in a shadowy limbo. It cannot be damaged until drawn into combat. Okay. So I guess I can go talk to it. Report to the toll master. Pay the toll. Oh. Just tell oh. You to talk to the toll master. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, it looks like you might be able to just climb up these roots too. So maybe we do just have to talk to the guy upstairs. Yep, whatever that that thing is. Come on, Skelly bro. Alright, so we're going upstairs. I'm, I'm, only, I'm only just now realizing how close your D&D uh, &D character and your Baldur's Gate 3 characters are. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, they both love talking to dead, summoning <laughs> dead, <laughs> being around the dead. Yeah, is Stoli also going to go Lich? That's right. <laughs> is that her life goal? Fun fact, that is something you can do in the Pathfinder RPG uh, video game RPGs. Really? Yes. This, these these stairs don't go anywhere, by the way. You can... There's... Oh, those stairs don't? Yeah, they just go back up to the street. Oh, shoot. So well, there, there are roots in the other room. Try going up the roots, then. Uh, yeah, well, there's also a, there's some stairs in here somewhere. Where were they? Right here. Uh, actually, I'm not sure if you can go up these stairs. Wow, the owlbear can sit on the dirty toilet seat. Okay. Just Why kinda... would the owlbear even bother to sit on the dirty toilet well, seat? Well, I clicked on it. Right, I'm going to ignore the pile of coins. I don't want to touch those cursed coins yet. I'm going to go talk to the other head. See what the other head has to say. You should leave now. I should have left when I still could. Just various warnings, I guess. I really want to pick up the coins, but then again, I really don't. Yeah, I, uh, I wouldn't do that. There's a door <laughs> over here I can open. Is this like an elevator behind. happening over here? Oh. Yeah, where I'm at, there's some stairs that go, that go up to this this creature, and it, it is just walking around dropping gold up here. I think you can click on these. Can you click on these roots and go up? Maybe. Yep. Try it. Yeah, there you okay. go. Okay. You're going up right next to her. Oh, shit. There it is. Oh. What do you ah. bring? What, uh... What do you bring? <laughs> I bring wine. Wine? <laughs> Everything from Mephits to Burning Infernos depends on the day, really. I bring you death. <laughs> <laughs> What do you require? Uh, I'm, I'm feeling five, not gonna lie. 
That is something you probably would say. I require gold. <laughs> Boy, she is gold. All right, it seems like you've got enough gold. You can pass, but first you must pay. It's. <laughs> I was gonna say that seems to me you have enough. <laughs> Oh, what a dick. Just flip one coin. Boy. She likes it, though. I require more! All that you have! <laughs> yeah, that's not happening. Mm -mm. Eh, take it all. Take it all! I don't want to start a fight without y'all up all here, right, I'm so... Up. I'm, I'm almost up. there, I'm yeah. Oh. Damn, I don't know where I am. Let me see. Oh, jeez. Alright, Albear in the... in the. I was about to go through a locked door outside. <laughs> of course you were. <laughs> Alright, I am literally right next to you. you may pass the river, Let's see, I see a skeleton. You must Wait, where are you? Uh, we went upstairs in the toll house. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Here to replace you as toll collector. Oh, you climbed the... Jesus, you have a plus ten. Oh, that feels like fun. This is why we let her fucking talk to everything. Forget. I'm going deception. Yeah, I think that gives you inspiration if you go deception. Oh, yeah. Oh, an Jesus, an 18. Okay. You got a plus 10. I know. We're gonna... Let's see here. Did I add a bend luck? No. Nah. We're gonna hope for the best. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah. How about a 28? Ha, <laughs> ha. Replace me. Huh. Needs a second check. Been promoted. You click go from much better toll house. You're doing a great job here. Really set the standard. <laughs> wow, um, okay. Deception it is again. Deception or persuasion, they're both the same. True, I just know I think you're as a charlatan, I think you specifically like doing are your Oh Jesus. Okay. It's harder after the first one? Okay. Oh, of course it is. <laughs> Thank you, Ray. <laughs> 21. Can you talk us out of another fight? Uh-oh. Nope. But we have a lot of inspirations, though, don't we? Yeah, let's try it one more time. Yeah. You still get the... You can do it. I believe in you. Bart, yeah. All right. Six. Try it one more time. Oh, there, there we go. go. We got it. <laughs> mm. Wow. A 33. <laughs> gold. More gold. I require gold. This, this is a one-note pony here. No. Yep. I paid back. What? Oh, what I just got an achievement for that, too. What is that achievement? Defeat the toll. I mean, you made a... What was the, what was the actual check on that? Deception? Uh, Defeat 21. the toll collector without 20. her using gold against you. Excellent budgeting. Wow. I think, uh, you just talked, I think you just talked us out of another fight. I think so, yeah. Mm -hmm. She literally it's died, too. You get to, like, loot her. Yeah. <laughs> I got a weapon from her, but I don't, I don't think I can use it. Let's see. It's a twist of fortune. All the visages died, too. Yes, they did. Oh, yeah, this is what I can't use this weapon, this but giant. I can. By the way, uh, somebody let me know that as a druid, if I use a one-handed weapon, I can still use shields. So I guess that's something to keep in mind. Oh, okay. 
Well, I'm glad we didn't have to fight. That's great. Yeah, yeah. We just talked her out of. We yeah. talked ourselves out of a lot of fights. Yes. I feel like. Turns out, super high number dialogue checks can get you out of a lot of things. There's also a lot of locked things in here. There's a locked safe and a locked door. I can't lockpick this stuff. They had oh. to use strength to open it. Oh, you, need, you got you a key to this thing, though. Safe. But you need strength to open the safe. Mm -hmm. He won't let me lockpick oh, it. Let me try. Let me let me get my burly muscles in there. The DC at sixteen. Well, I rolled an eighty. Nice. Oh, uh, my perception. This oh, that is here. a giant pile of money. It's a pile of gold. How much gold? Fourteen. Nice. Nice. <laughs> it's a giant pile of gold. Watch out, there's a... What? Oh, it's a trap? Loose floor, yeah, loose floorboards, I guess, in the middle of the room. I don't know... Right. Well, get your giant owlbear ass out of the way. Well, I don't think there's any way to disarm loose floorboards. <laughs> it's just pointing it out. So... Rotten floorboards. Jump. Maybe to... Uh... Right in the middle of the room. Yeah, you might be able to skirt the very left edge. I would just jump to the rug over there. I do not have a high enough strength score to jump to the rug. Oh, come on. There you go. Eh, Toll Collector statue actually is of the, like, monstrous... Oh, there's a shield in here I can give you. Oh, okay. Iron Vine Shield. That even and sounds the gritty. The is holding a weapon empowered with shillelagh, and when they are... Oh, shit. Hit by a melee attack, the attacker takes one piercing damage. Ha, <laughs> that is a druid hmm. shield. There you oh, go. I don't really use shillelagh, thank you. Can you give it to your, uh, nymph thing? Uh, I don't think they have inventory, but that would be pretty funny. Who keeps throwing things trying to block me in over here? I was trying to get the floor to go down with the cauldron. Uh, there is an option to attack it. What? What are you attacking? The floorboards. Oh, no, maybe it, it's not letting me attack let, them. Oh, maybe it lets you go somewhere. I, I mean, yeah, they have a four. I can I can target them with my bow. Yeah, maybe it takes. Let's, maybe it lets you go somewhere. All right, I'm doing it. I want to see what wait, happens. Wait, let me get out of here oh. first. <laughs> you just made it out. Huh. Oh. I don't know where it goes. It's like a, it's like a black pit down there. Oh, yeah. yeah. Everybody draws straws. I'm guessing it's a bad thing, but I don't know. So Maybe? The I can't. There is like a room under here, at least as I zoom out from the building. Oh, wouldn't it just be the lower floor we were already on? Uh, yeah. Oh, jeez. 10 health to jump down there. Wow. All right, I'll try it. Let's see what happens. Oh. Yeah, actually, it is blocked. I can see that. So there's like some junk in front of the doors here. Couple of chests. Some arrows, some money. Keller's book says something about on the wall hangs a seaside landscape, which often catches my eye during the course of my workaday life. I'm surprised Garing Goth chose such decoration for her toll house. Maybe we need to check out a seaside landscape picture. See if there's something behind it. Okay. Grab a trade master. I don't know what room it would be in. Is it downstairs where Chris is? It doesn't say where it is. I'm just reading a, a book on the skeleton. On the wall hangs a seaside landscape which often catches my eye during the course of my workaday life. Surprised it chose to decoration for a troll house. Never known as appreciative art nature, beauty, art, not but the cold clink of gold. So, it seems like a just another crate. good thing to look for. It's also locked doors on the other side, too. Do these open up with the same key? They do not. 
I need somebody who can pick locks back up here. Well, it's hard to get around your giant owlbear butt. <laughs> You're so big. So big. Why is there... Alright, where'd you go now? What, what are we lucky making? Uh, right here. Or this one. Curse to put my hand on everything. Sorry, not the torch. The thing next to the torch. <laughs> yeah, these two doors are both locked. What in the world? Where are these? Okay. No portraits in here. Just a giant chest. And there's a locked chest, too. So opulent. <laughs> there are gloves of battle mage's power. When open attack rolls inflicts a condition, the wheeler gains arcane acuity. Hmm. I'll take any, those if you don't want them. Yeah, any condition? Yeah. What's arcane acuity? Uh, uh, I believe it's the one that gives you like plus one to spells. Yeah. yeah. Anybody want it? I'll take it if you don't want it. Uh, it's in the chest. Can you? Uh, I'll, I'll send it to you. you. Right, yeah, you can right click on it and send it. Okay. Uh, I found it. What? Picture. Oh, really? Where was it? It said swamp under an autumn tree. Swamp. Now I was looking for a seaside thing. Yeah. Seaside. Well. I just assume there might be something behind it, because he's like, why would she have this? But I don't know where it is. Might be on the first floor. Well, it pinged on it. Oh, like there was something there? Mm-hmm. Oh, maybe. Seized inventory. How do I get in there? Something good here, I hope. It's also like ladders and shit going up to another level. Yes, there is. It's the roof. I'm on the roof. No roof. Why do we need to get on the roof? Oh, shadow curse. Because there's some more collapsed floorboards up here that I we could collapse and jump down. Oh. But I can see the room that they lead to. It's the seized inventory room that you can't get into from that lower level. I found another key. I'm not going down these stairs, damn it. This place is confusing. It is kind of confusing. Alright, I'm gonna check the first floor for that painting. So, there's a safe right here, and there's a letter next to it that says, If you find the safe, I'm inside. I had to shut myself in to avoid the shadows. There's what? no gold. You're thinking of killing me for it. Gearing off, moved it to her personal coffers, and unarmed anyway. Just let me out when the shadows are gone, and I'll find a way to repay you. I've only got three candles with me, so hurry. The combination no. un to unlock the safe has been written in big, bold handwriting below. Do I dare open this safe? Where oh. are you? Are you on the I'm... first floor or second floor? No, I'm right where you guys were. You just didn't look in this little room where the safe is. I'm on the second floor. Huh. Alright, this could be a trap, but I'm going to open it. <laughs> Let's open it. Oh, it's just a dead body. Yeah, I was gonna say. Aww. You can't last that long. <laughs> His pouch has rotten food, supply pack, and a garnet ring. Nice. Well, that was useless. Wait, is this? Did you already fall down that? Uh... I did. Okay. Did you see the button and stuff that was down there? Yes! That's how I got out. Okay. 
Well, let me now I'm in a different door down. Now I'm in a different room that I fell down. <laughs> Falling down all the rooms. Yeah, I can't find any portraits down here. So you're go you're going up? Me? Uh, the party, I guess. I don't know what else is to do in here. It's never really a quest, right? We're just we're just passing through. Yeah, we're I yeah, I think we're just yeah, we're just exploring the <laughs> place. Oops, the climb up. Yeah. Let's get to the whole roof level. Oh, you've already been here. Doesn't seem to be anything on the roof. Yeah, there was nothing but uh, a way down into that room, and I've I'm, I'm, I've gotten what's in that room, and I'm out of there now. Yeah. There's a uh, shadow cursed vines blocking this door over here. That, that's the room I was in. Yeah. Oh, that is okay. Which I'm gonna drop it. What I what I took from that room is a chest that was locked. Eh. There, somebody could open that chest. Wow, you carrying that around with you? I just carried the chest. You know? <laughs> a lot of locked things in this place. Mm-hmm. Got a fire heart necklace. Whenever you take fire damage dealt by another creature, you gain two turns of heat. Heat. That doesn't feel like it was worth it for you to carry it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest, you carried this for nothing. So I guess we're going back downstairs? I think so. I I'm, I'm not sure what else there is to do here. Yeah. I think. Oops, that's the wrong way. Uh, west, I think, is what we want to go. Because uh, if we go yes. too far south, we hit up Moonrise. Right, and we have a quest to the left, or west. Follow the owlbear's ass. <laughs> it's big and furry. Quick save. I'll be right back. Any one second. <sighs> north, North, Rythwin. East, Rythwin Toll House. South, Moonrise Towers. There you go. West, the Waning Moon. The no, Waning Moon. Waypoint dealy. Right here. Ah, yes. Is it active yet? I don't know how to tell. There you go. Waypoint is good. Oh, yep. Shit. Oh, jeez. Don't happening? don't don't step through that stuff. The it's holy fire. Oh no! The angel's been here. Yeah. Oh, maybe. Look at yeah. the look at the north. They're all incinerated, or the south. Oh shit! It's You're a whole right. bridge full of like burned people. So that is officially okay. like moonrise down there. Yep. Yep. I and mean, the angel has been through here. You're right. Yeah. All right. Well, we can always teleport back to there then. Right. The, te the, the the teleport point is called Moonrise Towers. Yeah. Guess we haven't. Oh yeah, we've been. Well, there's a technically some fog in the north, so we haven't been directly north, but. Okay, I'm back. Yeah. So if you look to the south, that's where the angel's been. There's just a road of burned out bodies and holy nice. fire. In a waypoint. Okay. So we don't want to go that way, right? Uh, eventually we do, but I think for now we're going to go uh, west, which is the Waning Moon. I don't know what that is, but then there's Punish the Wicked quest. Is Waning the Moon the, like, tavern or something? I actually yeah, the one, the one to the west, west is the... Uh, if somehow, yeah, it's kind of like... I get over there. It's kind of blocked. Uh, the one to the west, I remember, is the one that the weirdo with the crow gave it gave to us. That was a long to, time ago. It was to find a ledger that like proves that somebody betrayed her friends or something. Oh, oh shit! Oh. Sorry, I was. I, I didn't. I didn't think about running into enemies. What did you do? I was just was walking I... around. I. Just... <laughs> I didn't even occur what to me there'd just know? be enemies sitting around. Chris, do you know where he went? 
Uh, I'm with him, yes. Uh, I, uh, I just headed uh, north because the way west was kind of blocked. Yeah. Ow. And uh, there were some bad guys. I didn't even actually... Well, I guess... I wasn't even going your I, direction, Shadows. I was going this way. Exactly. We, we didn't mean to go up here. I didn't mean to go that way. All right, I see your giant Alvarez. Bunch of shadow... Shadow dudes. I managed to come in from the back, apparently. <laughs> wow. Right, yes. Oh, uh, I don't have any movement here. Start combat them so far back. They're all gonna get a chance to go. Here they come! Yeah, they're all dashing to you. Alright, I don't want to get next to you, right? Because you're going to do some... Um... Yeah, my AoE is just really effective, but my basic attacks are... what I'll do if, if there's friendly fire. Yeah, around, so. okay. I'll take the guys in the back. That's easy. Uh, let's see. Should I cast light on you, Chris? And then that way they can't go into the shadows and get super hits? Um, you could do that. I'd probably want to run up if you did that, yeah. Cow bears straight up blocking everybody. Except, Jesus, you are blocking me. I, I can't am. get up there. I, I'm blocking <laughs> my woodwo too. Yeah. Owl bear ass. Yeah, Your giant ass. Tangle those guys. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm jump. full tank mode right now. Right. Wow, yeah, I'm really blocking everything over here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, I Damn let it. your I let your bow up. There you go. Hold up. Wait, what? Warren needs a nine to hit. They rolled a twenty-two. A nine to hit. I rolled a twenty-two. What? Yeah, I'm also. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, if you want to use executioner when you kill a creature, your next attack will be a critical hit. Mm. So this will kill them, I guess. I don't know. You have fifty-one hit points. That's not possible. I, yeah, I'm not sure what they're doing yet. Jump, Woodwode! Nice, nice! Woodwode with the murder. And he loves the Entangled. <laughs> I love this combo. Not only does he is he immune to Entangled, but he gets regeneration while he's Entangled. Ah, uh, yeah. You, however... Oh. I am just entangled. Do I didn't think, entangled? I didn't think that would affect me, to be honest with you. <laughs> I'm a ranger. Exactly. So fast. Bouncy. Can't get close enough because of your butt. Yeah, Bouncy's got a bow. Oh, that feels like it's bad. Skeleton. Wait, where? Oh, yeah, that's fine. He can hit the skeleton. That's fine. How is he even hitting the skeleton? Oh, There's a he... bad guy behind you. Uh, yeah, there mm -hmm. is. None of these are wraiths, though, right? Just like garden variety. They're just mounds. shadows. They're shadows, yeah. Although they are doing their disappearing thing. Well, do I need to turn around and deal with that guy? Or... Uh, we should be okay back here. Ooh. Delicious. Oh yeah, that's right, I don't have bloodlust on. I'm not a god right now. Let me get more of those. <laughs> Woodwode can help. Help, Woodwode! Magic bonking stick. Bonk! Aw. Brad's gonna miss. Level 10. Come on, Triad. This guy's immune to poison. Let's see. Shadows? Probably. 
punched him for one. <laughs> ah, they only have an AC of 13. Missing them is hard. <laughs> right. Would, would help friend to come here? <laughs> I was confused by that for a second. I was like, is someone <laughs> punching me in the back while I'm standing here? I love the design of this creature, too. It's so cool looking. It's cool looking, yeah. Give me that radiating orb. Yeah, like the worst thing to do to a shadow. <laughs> now the light. Oh. What? You can just disappear and get I, rid of it? I, well, that's. Yeah, I guess. Oh, jeez, what about? That hurt. Yeah. Well, I was gonna go back and kill the attack that shadow, but he's fucking gone now. What the hell? Hmm. Don't walk into my own tangle. Here we go again. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> Swift as my feet can carry me. Survive, Woody. Back to those. No one around us anymore. Yeah, I don't know where he is. I can't... There's only two of them left now. Well, I thought the one that was right here disappeared. He did. I like that. <laughs> Alright, giant outdoor ass. Alright, where, where are the enemies now? Oh, I'm lost. You are entangled. Uh, and I am entangled, so it doesn't matter. I can shoot. Uh, there's one by... Ray, and then I, there's one that's supposedly by Stoli, but I think it disappeared. I don't know. Okay. Or no, no, it's on the ground. Oh, it's this one. Okay, yeah. yeah. It's right, right there on the ground. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Okay, I can hit this guy. Oh, wait, he went invisible again. What the, what the fuck? Why did he appear for a second and then disappear? Oh, God. Yeah. How did we get him before? I don't know. That was weird. I have no idea. Huh. He was there, and then he wasn't there. Yeah. How is that working? And if you click on their portraits, it doesn't take you anywhere. Yeah. Really? They're... Yeah. Huh. They're... Nice. So there's still two left. So maybe there's still one by you. Petrified tumor. I mean, is there like a hold action button? Huh. <laughs> I wish there was. Yeah, I do not. Overwatch mode. Mm-hmm. I wish they had like the XCOM Overwatch where you could like sit like a cone. Like, all right, if anything comes in this in yeah. this zone, oh. do this thing. Oh, my bones. What? That was like horror movie too. Like Brandon did that and disappeared. Yeah. I don't know where the other one went. Um, it keeps disappearing like an asshole. We need like another yep. light spell? I don't know. I've got light. I mean, Heather cast light on my bow. Run around. There you go. Yeah, okay. I guess, oh, that's yeah, where you yeah, yeah. take the bow out. I, I, I got to take the bow out. Yeah, you're right. That's what happened when he appeared and disappeared. Yeah. All right. Well, I can't move, unfortunately. So. <laughs> well, he's not around you. We know that. He's much. not around me. Exactly. Oh, my goodness. I won't give in. Uh, yeah, there is no Overwatch or anything, so. Everybody just get around. Yeah, get near Chris, I guess. 
Huddle near the light. <laughs> I'm gonna... Oh shit, I forgot I had sun skin on. Shit. Not anymore. Not anymore. There he is. Well, not me. Not me. Right, oh thank god. Critical man. There he goes. <laughs> Goodness. Is your woodwog dead? No, Woodward's fine because I he was in the entangle, so he's able to heal. Ah, uh, yeah. Can you raise one of these harpers to make another skeleton? Uh, I'm not sure, but there's half plate armor and a great sword on this guy. All right, I'll take that. You can sell it, please. Let's see here. Yeah. Studded leather. Um. I failed my perception check over here. Oh, slow down. Really? Where are we? This is like the middle of the... So did I. Town. Wait. But it's still lit the, something up. The, uh, it's a plaque. What's it say? Oh boy. Our L Mr. Wen Nai Thorm. <laughs> it's like... Yeah, this piece plaque of... is something similar like that too. Oh. Okay. Four lady. Lines, okay, our lady. Our lady of, of loss, loss. Mistress of Mistress pain. Of pain. All. Oh wait, entertainer tail huh? or something happened. What? Yeah. <laughs> Someone getting inspiration for doing something. What? What did we do? Oh, it opened a door. <laughs> yeah, it's over here. Wait, how did we solve it? I'm still in the middle of. <laughs> I think. I think probably there was an order to clicking on the plaques. Okay. Oh, to like to like read it, but we but all of us were clicking on we the We were just all clicking skeleton. it, so once again we brute force. <laughs> brute it. The skeleton is a note. The right wind town crier notes are scribbled across the page. Listen up, fresh bread at the waning moon, free with every order. News from the towers, ignore all talk of invading forces. This is a rumor, I repeat, there is no invading force. Leftover no. corpses, the house of healing seeks bodies for study, discretion guaranteed. Attention, boy Wait. missing, age nine. If found, return to Freya ten toes at toll house. Reward. Okay. Sharon's Sanctuary. Oh, this is a whole thing. This is a thing, yeah. It's I don't know where this goes. We're going in? No, oh, I went in. Sorry, I thought you guys were going in. <laughs> Let's go in. We Why opened, we opened the door to a puzzle room. I'm not, not going <laughs> in here. We're not, not going in. Follow the giant air belt. Albert House. More productive provo productive provocative uh Shar statues in here? Yep. Statue of Shaw. You cannot use that right now. Oh, Albert oh. cannot read the plaque. Oh, this uh, feels like it's gonna be bad. There's gotta be another puzzle in here, then, right? This is otherwise nothing in here. I found one. Oh shit! Okay, what I, the plaque that term, took me into a narrative thing is like asking for a charisma saving throw. I'm gonna let one of you. Mine's guys... asking for a, an intelligence saving throw. All right, we gotta divide this up because I'm not I'm not gonna do the charisma saving throw. None it's of us are gonna have point. intelligence. We're not. No, we're not. I have, I have charisma. Where's that one? Uh, it's this one right here. Everybody, check the stats and see. Okay. Int I don't have. Nobody has int. Like, it's no, like unless a you're playing a wizard, or you nobody's gonna have good int. And sharp of tongue. Can you turn any and all to the dark lady's cause? Wait. This is also charisma. Oh no, it's you. That's, I'm, I'm looking at you. Okay. Yeah. Four, five, six, yeah. seven, eight. Plus eight is pretty good. That's pretty good. Fourteen. Yeah, you got it. Ooh. <laughs> you, needed you needed all every those bonuses. <laughs> that was the lowest number you could have rolled. You feel like there is nothing you can't do. No <laughs> one you can't win over. The statue seems to agree. And approve. What an asterisk. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What does that mean? Dark Lady one? Grace. I have earned Shar's signature of charming nature. I have a plus five bonus to charisma until finishing the next long rest. Wow. Oh, damn. So just a chance to get a buff, I guess? Mm hmm. I think so. All right. The intelligence one is not. All right. What's the other one? Do you think yourself. It's wisdom. Enough? To be granted Shah's blessing. 
Are you uh, wise enough? I have advantage for some reason because I've amulet of the Harpers. I don't know why, no, but no plus. But I have no plus. And a fourteen is pretty high. I'm a, one of you. Well, you druid. I guess you're the only one with the high wisdom. I think right? I have to D shape, but yeah. My int and wiz are both plus twos right now. You might be able to try, try the int one then. My wiz is a plus six wisdom uh, saving throw. You think yeah. it takes away my charisma one if I do the end? Oh, maybe. Good I don't question. know. Shaw's test if I don't want to lose my charisma one. Well, hang on. Right. Who's got the best? Intelligence. Grumnir's got a minus one. I've got mm -hmm. a plus two. Apparently I'm proficient. Uh, I mean... Vorna's got a plus two, and Stoli's got a plus oh, two. I used rolled a 15. Oh, sorry. I'm not even looking at he, he just did the intelligence one. Okay. <laughs> Pulse of energy race up your Dark spine. Lady's erudition. A strange sensation of acceptance. Basically the same as mine, but just for int. This gives you a boost. Which one's the wisdom one? The one in front of you. You cannot use that. Yeah, well, let me use it. I, I can deshape, I guess. Mm. Is it worth a D-shape to get some wisdom bonuses? Well, I wonder if doing all three does something, but... It might. Yeah, that's true. If we succeed on all three, it might get, like, some other bonus. Some yeah. Other, like, it. unlock or something. Ugh. Druid form. Let me equip that shield while I'm thinking about it. <laughs> there we go. My put putrid dwarf body. My putrid dwarf body. Do you think yourself wise enough to be granted pretty wise, I guess. <laughs> Oh, a veritable sage. 14 plus 6. Pretty good odds. Wait, why can't I give myself... Guy oh, because it's a saving throw. Mm, well, right. Oh, no. That's not going to do it, though. I feel like that's a good use of uh, inspiration. Yeah, I got a plus 6. What's you, inspiration were, you were one like? off, I think. Yeah, we have 4. I'm going to use 1. <laughs> there you go. All right. A warm. We got a nice bank of inspiration we built up too. Uh, yes, we do. We're not going to fail any checks, I think, in the you near future. Uh, assuming we always have somebody doing the right one, I guess we could be caught in a right. situation. Oh, look at that! It did. Yep, yep. You're right. All right, that was worth it. It opened up a new thing. Plus five bonus to wisdom. That's crazy. That's gonna make us all really strong. Where is that shield that I got? You have 22 right now, jeez. That is crazy. An altar to Shah. It appears to seek prey hmm. and a blood offering. Your blood. Wait, seek prey or seek prey? <laughs> These subtitles right. say prey. That, 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 that sentence Why? is, uh, yeah. Oh boy. Wow, just no hesitation. Let's That's go! Raise I mean, a devout. we'll see what happens. <laughs> well, our hands are so scarred from doing that fucking other one. Elixir of necrotic resistance, potion of jealous reprieve. Oh, all these things popped up. Oh, oh yeah, you're right. A bunch of scrolls and... Ooh, Revivify. That's good. We spent a oh, lot. Oh, <laughs> wow. Potion of angelic reprieve sounds sexy. Drink to fall into a two-turn slumber. Unless interrupted, you gain the benefits of a short rest and gain all first and second level spell slots. Damn. Oh, if you are damn. awoken before the duration expires, the effects will not apply. That's hilarious. Just go into a sleep and get a kind of kind of long rest? Kind of sort of long rest? Can you use it outside uh -oh. of combat, though? I bet you could. Well, I don't know. Wait, don't do anything yet until we take the things. <laughs> yeah. Probably either... Yeah, Heather, do you want to take the Yeah, potion? I would love that potion. But get your spell slots back. It, it gives you a short yeah, it gives you a short rest plus regenerate all your first and second level spell slots. That's pretty great. Yeah, I would love this potion. Can I take it? Yeah, yeah take it. Yeah, take it. You could do it during combat, but you have to fall into a two turn slumber. It's also an elixir brutal. of necrotic resistance. Yeah, go take it. Yeah. So do we all get to talk to Shar now? That's a good question. All right. I'm gonna try. Else could try. Yeah. I think Ray did it again, and it said uh, you could well, you know, take, take the dagger. dagger that time. Yeah. Hmm. Shar's probably not gonna like that. Nah, I'm not taking no dagger. Yeah. 
I don't need daggers anyway. Probably take away our stuff. Although the dagger... Yeah, it's not it's the good. Not, it's, it's, it's a plus like one great. dagger, yeah. Shar giveth well, gifts. Do it's not a, piss off Shar. It's a plus one dagger that also deals an extra 1d4 piercing and 1d4 necrotic damage. It's actually a pretty, pretty decent little dagger there. But none of us are worth using daggers. Alright, well I'm a real good fucking druid now all of a sudden. What does that mean on my like to hit with this shit? Jesus. Not for the life of me figure out where that damn shield went that I got that I was gonna give to you. Uh, I got it. You gave it to me. Oh, I did? Okay. Yep, I'm actually using it right now. It's strapped to... Uh, or, I don't know, I'm not holding it, I guess. Huh. Yeah, it looks cool. It looks like uh, the shield my woodboat has, basically. It's like a tree bark thing. I'll be right back. I'm gonna put my child into her bed. Why am I glowing all blue and shit? Is this what... Is that just the light spell? Throw it out of save. Oh, uh, that's our Shar effect, I think. Hmm. Oh, who else screams? <laughs> his, uh, yeah. his trapped fairy thing occasionally screams. Oh, right. Uh, we're still here in the fairy. It's the penalty we have. We're gonna. Uh, we're gonna eventually have to deal with that fairy, I think. I don't know. I feel like she's just a member of the party now. Just yeah, yeah. Just her screams of. It's like we're villains and she's just one of our lackeys. Alright, what I was trying to do was to go west. I found a way through over there earlier. Yeah, and then these guys aggroed. No, there was a way through back where we were. Oh, okay. And now I got turned around. Shit. I don't know where I'm going. I. I one of the options and told my map to not move. Mm -hmm. Alright, so this is north. Which we don't need to go north. I was trying to go. There's a locked door up here. Oh, and then you can just go west over here. Okay, this is where I was trying to go before. And then I noticed there was a locked uh, door onto the second floor. The waning moon. Yeah, well, this shield, now I feel like I should have taken Shillelagh. Net 20! Oh, this is the winning move. Nice. Okay. We're there. We're there. Oh, that looks fun. Just a black space. Why is it dark? It's kind of foreboding. I don't want to go in here. I'll charge. Okay. It's a storage room. Are there any candles up there? Some rotten cheese. And get some drink. This door did not need to be locked. <laughs> There's nothing in here. There's a bunch of rotten food. The locked door where they keep the rotten food. Yeah. Scruffy vagabond clothes. Actually, those kind of look nicer than my current clothes. <laughs> 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 I'm wearing whatever like newbie commoner because actual clothes don't ever get like changed. Right. It's armor. just it's just in the camp. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, I could go ahead and change these out now. Where are they? I found yeah. an absolute outfit. Oh, they are very scruffy though. Jeez. Wait, absolute's outfit. Mm -hmm. That sounds handy. Where is it? Yeah, yeah, an absolute outfit. It takes place of my homely clothes. Oh, there's people mm -hmm. talking in there. Oh, really? Uh, blighted archer. I can see it through the window. There's another door in front of us. Are we going to just keep going that way? There's a... Uh, 
Oh, there's another guy over here. These are all... They're yellow, but I gotta imagine they're gonna be hostile? I don't know. They're undead. Yeah. It's another storage room. A wine rack. Alright, who jumped through the window? Lorna just jumped <laughs> through the fucking window. Just the crashed. This doesn't actually get us... Yeah, you're right. Maybe jumping in the window is the way to go. Or just walk around down in, in there, why don't we actually? Yeah, this upper story is not. Although, being up there, if you could shoot people through the window, it would probably be effective. Oh, I'm going downstairs. Assuming we can make it through. Yeah, we can. Okay. Just out of view. Alright. There's. Yeah, one person Waning to the. Moon Distillery. No last call until the casks are dry. One person there. And then. Welcome to the Waning Moon. To lifelong friends, both old and new. Although these guys are yellow, they're not red. Right? Mm-hmm. Well, Vorn is like right next to that. Of another fight? That's right, do it! Uh, maybe. I want to pickpocket this guy. <laughs> oh, gosh. That's something we haven't tried yet. Are you guys just walking then up you, to him? You should have taken Rogue. Hmm. He's got nothing on him. Wait, you just walk? Okay. I guess they're not uh, hostile. Then I'm gonna react. Yeah. Oh! Of course the bar is full of the friendly undead. Mm -hmm. I guess the hospital was technically friendly too until we... It was, yeah. The boss. And the boss was even, like the boss of the hospital was even like... He was so crazy, he wasn't like hostile, hostile. He was like, yeah. I'm gonna make you join me in death, sort of, because we, we love it. That's true. Yeah. I talked this out of that one, too. You did, yeah. Yeah. Okay, these guys don't even seem to care about us. Got the ready. I'm supposed to find something in here? No. Supposed to find a ledger. Somebody turned in their friends, and that crow man wants their proof. Oh, this old bald form is down here, the wretched distiller. Oh. The wretched distiller. He's a, he's a big guy. He had the same last name as Thor, they, what if they, they're related? Probably, he has 288 hit points. Holy shit. Well, I assume, oh, he is a big boy. Ha! Your puny attacks can't break through the numbness, this old feels. He is immune to slashing, piercing, bludgeoning, and thunder immune. damage. Oh no! That's not oh, good! Oh no! Owlbear <laughs> don't like that! Physical yeah. attacks have added gas to Thistlebold's special brew. Oh. He has dark vision, extra attack, he's immune to control undead, he'll take opportunity attacks, and has turn resistance. He's... Examine his, like, fucking model. Like, this dude is mm -hmm. insane He is looking. just... He's like, like a hippopotamus you... on the bottom. Yeah. Oh, he's got four legs! I yes. didn't see that! He's a straight up like hippopotamus on the bottom. Wow! With a giant okay. gun. He's like a centaur hippo. That's wild. With a mask and like a beer keg weapon. That's fucking crazy. It, and the beer keg's like feeding him like Bane? Like Bane it's style, like... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fabulous, just fabulous. Oh man, I don't want to get closer to that. That's terrible, he's immune to like... He's Blob. He's the Blob. He's the Blob, mm -hmm. exactly. And yet, not hostile, so... Yeah, yeah. So well, if anybody's talking to him, him, it's gonna be you. You know that. Yeah, I'm gonna have to talk to him. Alright, I'll go talk to him. It's the House of the Holy all over again, where it's just the... Everybody's fine until we roll up on the boss. Mm -hmm. Hey, you sit at the bar! <laughs> I give zero shits. Oh my god. Oof. That's some pudgy fingers right there. Hey, Java. Go back down where you whistle. Tell your story. 
Oh god. <laughs> He's so big. Please don't make me angry. <laughs> you're, so, you're so tiny. You're like boob height with him. <laughs> yeah, I know. I don't even think I'm boob height. I'm sitting back <laughs> on a stool. So. That's true. Yeah. 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 That's true. I, I think the top height. of my head might be hitting his under boob. Oh, yep. I'm not a doctor, but I would not drink that liquid. <laughs> uh, you don't have any like sassy things you can say either. <laughs> nope. It's like either drink, I'm not, dr I'm not drinking or attack. Just so not going to do it. You want to come down here and uh, you know get prepared. Well, That'd be great. Yes, but I have a feeling all the guys around are probably going to go hostile as well. So. Uh huh. I will. I don't want to be the only one down here with I, this guy. <laughs> I'm, I'm next to you. Alright. Oh, didn't talk us out of that one. Oh shit! Alright, we gotta fight. We gotta fight. What even an option on this guy? Oh. Yep, all the dudes turned hostile. Well, me and Chris are not going to be very useful against the boss. No, no, not but at all. I will be. Although I'm not <laughs> owlbear form, so maybe I could just cast spells. Oh yeah, yeah. Do, do your call lightning thing and yeah, start exactly. blasting. I can kill some of these zombies. The yeah. blighted barman, patron, actor, troubadour. Yeah, they all turn hostile. Hey, everybody. Um, so Spike Girl's not going to do shit to him because that's piercing. Try to entangle him. Dude has got some big saves. A plus seven to his strength save, a plus six to con saves, and plus six oh, to wisdom this, saves. This guy's immune to necrotic. And poison, apparently. <laughs> yeah. So. Skeletons. Oh, yeah. 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 That sounds about right. Alright, but Call Lightning does lightning damage. Yeah, so that should still be useful. Yeah, he's Not only immune to slashing, piercing, bludgeoning, and thunder. Alright, we'll do some lightning. Not ass. Not a little Very, very ass. frightening. Damn, 1923, that's pretty good. Yeah. Now he has electrified reflux. Oh. What does that mean? <laughs> Oh, really? I thought you were making a joke! <laughs> Lightning damage has changed the nature of Thizzabald's special brew. Careful, adding additional elemental flavors might make the mixture worse. What is happening? Okay. I just charged his beer. <laughs> oh, I'm about to throw some fire in his beer. Uh, it just warned us against doing that. Curses. Oh, let's give his beer all the elements. God. I guess I could... Man, now I want to know what would have happened if I drank Thizzabald's. Right? Uh, yeah. Shit, that was concentration too. God damn it, I keep doing that. Oh, it's already using that action. Casting a concentration spell, forgetting they have a concentration spell. Oh, you know, we missed this before. Up. The game does a bad job of reminding you that you've got that. It should ask, it, it, it right? Should ask. Should there should be a yeah. tooltip that's like, are you sure you're going to break it's concentration? Al it's already popping up for every reaction thing that you yeah. might want to do. So why not pop up and say like, hey, you're going to drop concentration on blank. Yup. I tangle you. No. Doesn't look like it. <laughs> Doesn't look like it, yeah. You're tangle the other guy. Ah, uh, he made the save though, unfortunately. Another fight. Let's go. Light on my feet. Just got Thizzabald. Oh, now he made the save. Damn it. Oh no, the electrified regurgitation. Oh! <laughs> what? Oh, what the fuck was all that? He stunned both of us and did a shit ton of damage. And summoned a hallucination? And summoned a hallucination. Well, that's not great. And what's this uh, big 
ring around y'all too. <laughs> it's the hallucination is doing something. It's giving acid resistance. Oh, acid resistance. oh okay. I can kill that with my wood woad, but <laughs> Thorm is now moderately mod moderately inebriated. Great. He has disadvantage of charisma dexterity checks and has startled hallucinating imps. <laughs> start casting. Lovely. We will took a lot of damage and we're stunned. That's really bad. That's bad, mm -hmm. yeah. We're stunned for two fucking turns. Oh, Woodwode, you asshole. You missed that. Good. Better, do it. Damn it. Animal oh, electrocuted. Shit. Yeah, that's real fucking bad. I I lost my call lightning concentration immediately too. Yeah. Oh right, because you got put to sleep yeah. or stunned. Uh, gosh. did farm at? Do I just go. Is it better to kill that? Well, I'll kill that there. Better to tank some blows here somewhere. Shit. Yeah, I'll come down. Yeah, it's. What? Ow. Two critical misses in a row? That's what the fuck? Not great. Bonk, Dryad, bonk. Good oh, what? Well, one life left. Damn it all to oh, hell. Oh my goodness. Son of a bitch. Although I kind of wish I wasn't sitting next to you all where he could throw his. <laughs> AOE's yeah, spirits. he did a straight up cone at us. I wonder if you can only do that because I shocked him with lightning. I maybe. Oh yeah, yeah, that's probably it. it. Like the stun is coming from the lightning. But you got to hit him with elemental stuff. He can't take any other damage. Exactly, but it makes him stronger. Mm. What a terrible boss. Nice. Wait, did y'all heal? Yeah. A little bit. We're still stunned though. Yeah. That's my last one. Hopefully his Thank base you. hit wasn't too bad. Oh, well, don't get up next to me. Alright, fucking kill that one already. That's all I can do. Oh, it gives everybody the resistance, okay. Uh, hopefully it doesn't do much damage. Uh, four to set. Yeah, let me take it. It's fine. <laughs> I forgot that dude was up there. So nice before. He was! He was singing a song! Jesus, one life! One life! What? <laughs> We're doing a bad oh, job oh, of killing oh, this wait, guy. Hold on. Who has one life? The, the zombie next to me? The blinded actor? actor? And... I killed, the the one one. Uh, I killed the I killed the I killed the one in front of Woodwood. Oh, you killed that one. Okay. Yeah. Here, let me do that. Uh, let me do this here. Oh damn. Uh, don't worry about that. Nice. Okay. Wait. Oh, Wait. is he Wait, getting what? the undead fortitude? Is that what's happening? Oh shit! That uh, is what's happening. He keeps he's raising back up. Yeah. Healed for one hit point. Yes. Damn it. Except it doesn't. So he's. It doesn't say on there, but he is a zombie. Shit. All right. Well, I'm gonna try again. Can't keep getting it. There we go. Oh, it's completed. <laughs> nice. Still slapping a tangle. Uh, is this guy immune to poison? Did we determined that. Oh, I did get him entangled. That's good. He's not immune to poison. He's, he's not immune not. to any of the elementals. Okay. Yeah, he's immune to thunder and all the basics, but it charges his thing full of <laughs> sweet energy when he does. Yeah. I'll walk behind him, actually. Yeah, we need just, to spread just out. So we can't, just so we can't AOE all of us. Yeah. Oh, oh. that's nice. Just gonna smash you. Okay. Go, go, he's, solid he's AC. Drunk. He is drunk. Ah, I can't get away from him. Tag I mean, of opportunity. I, I actually have an AC of 20 right now. Since I 
thankfully I realize I now can wear a shield. Oh, right, yeah. That's solid. Well, I guess I could drop a cloud of daggers on him because he's not really moving. That would, well, yeah. Well, that's piercing, and isn't he's... it? Oh. Uh, it's slashing. Well, yeah, he's immune to... Is he immune to slashing? Yeah. Let's see. Piercing, bludgeoning. No, it doesn't say slashing. Oh no, it does say, it just does say it's, slashing. It's slashing yeah, it's all the normal weapon attacks he's immune yeah, to. Yeah, yeah, slashing, piercing, bludgeoning, and thunder. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. So, Stoll, you need to get good, far good away idea. and just Any lay down enemy, that great. elemental attacks because we can't do shit against this guy. Well, the problem is if I try to move away from him, he's going to hit me with an opportunity attack. Sure is. Uh, well, hammer. he was entangled a second ago, but I guess he's not right now. All right, well. I'll give him disadvantage. Oh. His main attack it's, wasn't this, that bad. But... This still might be a good one, though. You only need a one to make it not hit. Yeah. Yeah. It's... Yeah. Screw yeah. you. What the hell did I just do? Damn it, wood wood. That was the animation for your Ben Luck. Oh, okay. All right. I'm coming up here. <laughs> I'm safer up here. All right. <laughs> yeah. Attack the wood All right. bastard. Dropping a fireball on his butt. Now, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, fine, I'll do magic missile. There you go. He's not immune to force. I wonder what force does to his brew. What a terrible boss. Imagine if I, th I threw a boss at you guys in D&D that was like, <laughs> straight up immune to bludgeoning, slashing, and piercing. <laughs> yep. Like, okay. Although the radiant orb is amazing. He has a minus one ten times. To his Nothing. attack rolls. Okay. So we got minus ten. Eh, don't worry about it. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh. Dust condition, dark one's blessing. There you go. Attack the wood mood. Uh, unfortunately, my summons both do just normal fucking damage too. Right. That's not terribly helpful. Well, if there's so much focus on other guys. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. There's a patron down here I'm hitting. Do I have the shillelagh on? Yeah, I do. Ensnared. Survival is all that matters. Oh, I'm alive, but at what cost? Thank you. And I'm afraid to cast Chain Lightning on him again. <laughs> right? Because that was kind of awful. But yeah, giving him that lightning power to his brew is, yeah. Yeah, that was bad news. The only reason I would shift would just be defensively, but you can actually do that. Well, he doesn't have the brew thing on anymore. It says he's moderately inebriated. Each sip of his special brew makes Thistlebold more intoxicated. He has disadvantage on charisma and dexterity checks and has started hallucinating imps. But, like, the brew that he had before, the lightning, whatever it was... Uh, lightning form or whatever, it's all gone. Oh, I wonder if that was only one a one-time thing. Maybe. We could, I just afraid I mean, if I do still... that, it just charges him again, but I'm not sure. Yeah. Well, I hit him with fire and it didn't do anything. That's hmm. true. I could try it again and just but get yeah. the hell away from him because he's... Right. Yeah. Like AoE. Alright. He's also in water too, so that'll electrocute him. Ooh, I think oh, I geez, yeah. Just. Oh wait, I don't want to be electrocuted. Let me step back a little bit. <laughs> All right. I think I can actually get both him and the dude without getting either of you to. Let's see. Do it right there. Nice. Yeah, I did get electrified reflex. Shit. Oh, yeah. it did. It did happen. Oh, Maybe okay. it's just the lightning then that does that. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah. It was a Fire cone, didn't do so I'm, I'm just gonna get away from him. Maybe, hopefully, he'll focus the wood mode. Yeah, do the summons, you asshole. What throwables do I have Myself. that can I can use? This so this is what would happen if you did this: is that we would have to like go through our inventories and be like, all right, what things do we have to do other types this, of this damage? This is a fight you do not play if you are having like four barbarian playthrough or something. Exactly. Like, what do you do? Was he I mean to have, acid? I guess you could have like no. I've got a weapon that does some radiant damage. So I guess if you have the right weapons, you could technically right get around it. 
but you wouldn't be doing much. Oh shit! Uh, wow, that also hit your wood woad. Sorry. Did. And it set the world on fire. That's unfortunate. I don't think he's gonna heal now. Yeah. Well, if he survives this fight, it'll be a miracle. If either someone survives, it'll be a miracle. <laughs> because he's probably they're gonna take the brunt of his electric cone. Yeah, probably. Possibly. Oh. Rotten reflux. Oh, okay. It replaced your electric. It did. Where's what is rotten reflux? Uh, radiant damage? Huh. Maybe it's just a chance? I don't know. Oh, it, no, it says a combination of elements has turned oh. Fizzlebald's special brew into a foul mixture. He has had worse, but have you. Okay, so we've supercharged him now. Oh, we've that was the thing that warned us. So if he hadn't used it before we do multiple elements, suddenly it gets like Yeah, super yep. Oh, so unfortunately, me doing radiant damage added badness onto it. Well, yeah, I'm sure the summons are going to bite it here. We'll find out. Find out. Does he get to go next? Yeah. Okay. Where are you going, buddy? He's leaving the dryads. He's coming after me. Summons. He's coming after you. <laughs> yep. Oh, here he comes. Here's oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, me. balls. <laughs> well, Rotten that was regurgitation. Fucking bad. He's profoundly intoxicated, and I'm dead. You are dying. Yeah, yeah. I, I can bring up with Healing Word or. Because I'm in druid form. This Abald is on the verge of passing out from his heavy drinking. Oh. What? Profoundly That's what profoundly intoxicated, intoxicated okay. me. Wonder what that does. A lot of mechanics here that we don't understand. There are. I wonder so if it makes like... the numb go away. Okay. It's almost like we have to infuse him with elements for him to drink and then he gets drunker and drunker exactly yeah and then he passes out at some point we have, yeah. to, we have to encourage his drinking oh that's fun i already have one failed death save i saw that yeah uh well it's not my turn yet when it is i can keep you back up <laughs> i don't know if i want you to <laughs> well let's see oh shit yeah because i'll get you up and then he gets to go oh it's terrible timing yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's it's definitely not great. It's not great. Ah, stupid fucking fire. Uh. What? He's on fire. <laughs> no, it. Okay. I guess those barrels were full of fire? I didn't pay attention. <laughs> no, the wood woad was already on fire. So adding... Entangles adding a, spreads yeah. the fire? Well, shit. So yeah. I guess I've never done that before. You walk in the water? Does that turn off the fire? We're, we're really having to, like, stretch ourselves here. Uh, it does not, apparently. I'm walking in water right now. <laughs> Yikes. Well, so much for peace. Well... What shall I do? I still have exactly. I still have call light, so I can call lightning him again, and then I can healing word Stoli. But uh, yeah, you're gonna be in a bad spot. Yep. Mm. That's fine. Ah, uh, keep giving it that electrified reflux. Though, I don't like it. Right. But it's like. Solid things. Oh, you feared him! Oh, nice! He dropped his weapon. Can you pick his weapon up? Brewing ladle. <laughs> Jesus. What is happening? Wait, why did he get rotten reflex again? Fuck! Sorry. I keep All I can do is throw things at him, and they keep giving him more elemental things. Oh, well, yeah, shit. Well, I took his weapon. Okay, that's good. You took his weapon. Okay, that is great. <laughs> Right. Yeah, Level I'm two healing die. word. Then, yeah, we just gotta spread the fuck out away from this guy. 
He did. He still came after me and killed yeah, me. He did. He's real mad at me because I didn't drink with him. <laughs> How dare. I mean, the last time I drank something, I ended up being teleported somewhere else, so. That's very true. Uh, These boots just run away, because I'd like to keep Call Lightning if I can. Even though it's making him do terrible things. Although I blame Chris for that. Oh, he's still fearful, though! Nice! That's great! Okay. Yeah. Alright, what do How you like my multi-classing now? Who needs to not be on fire? <laughs> it's not working out for him. Is that, is that warlock fear that we're seeing? Is that what that is? No, I guess not. Yeah, it's where did a that bard. Come from? It's a level. It's a level three. Okay. God damn it! I wanted to spear, spear for less than a turn. Okay. Well, I don't know what to do. My summons. So, all right. I want to cast entangle, try to heal Woodbode, but it's not going to do it because he's still on fire. Why is this still on fire? Uh... Oh, Wait, we left that guy alone? I, they only I, have for I forgot about that one guy. More turn of yeah, this is their last turn of burning. Yeah, so the the Dryad is free of it. The Woodwode will be free next turn. Alright, but so you're saying if I try to cast Entangle on Woodwode, it would just set it on fire, fire to where? Okay. Yeah, he's on fire. He's burning. Well, I can't do anything with her then. Take care of that guy. I could try to topple him, knock it prone, but he's already fearful, which seems pretty good, so. I'll just uh, stand here. I wonder if this is worth the cost. Shane lightning your ass again. Although he's probably gonna get his fucking rotten thing up. Yeah, and all I can I mean literally I, I could I, I can either throw things at him that do elemental damage. Ooh. Or shoot him with arrows to do elemental damage. Yeah, I'm getting some good... Oh, it's gonna take forever though, man, with this... It is, it feels like... As long as I can not lose... Concentration... Which I can just go around this corner. Potion of healing. Can't slow down. There we go. <laughs> Such a weird, uh... I, I'm usually the one up front, like, doing melee shit. Right? Instead of behind the round corners. It's an interesting fight because we're, I'm just being forced to use all of my throwable items, which is a good way to empty my inventory, I suppose. Yeah. Okay, he's no longer fearful. I'm tempted to go up and vampiric touch him so I can steal his hit points and his life force and get hit points back. Uh, Damn it, it's spread the fucking yeah. fire again! Oh no! Son of a bitch. Not. I'm a druid. I don't like any bits of fire. <laughs> I can do a scroll of stinking cloud. Create a cloud of gas so nauseating it prevents creatures from taking actions. Pretty good, but he's got a good con save, too. He's got a plus six. Wow. Anything you've got with deck saves? Or just attack rolls. AC of 16 is kind of medium, I guess. Oh, he... He right now has fire resistance for one... Oh, I guess he's wet. Mm -hmm. Oh, he right. Fire resistance, okay. but he's, he's vulnerable to lightning and cold. For a turn. How about a scroll of Witch Bolt, then? That that's lightning. Do That'd be double great. damage, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, do that, and then do what I'm doing. Hide around corners, because that's fucking concentration. <laughs> You cast shield on yourself. It's increased by five, and I'm immune to the effects of magic missile. Woo! Eh, that's good. <laughs> so do you get to concentrate on it, or no, because you missed? No, because I missed. Oh, man. <laughs> Damn it. I'm killing the guy still alive. <laughs> We're just, we just yeah. ignored him so much. Well, Chris, you should go take care of that guy. I, sh I should take care of that guy, yeah. <laughs> like... I can take care of that uh, guy from way over here. I could probably take care of him. Oh, nice. Do you have another attack on him? Yep. 
It is worth spreading. Oh. Except his Fire. stupid... Oh, Undead Fortitude. Undead Fortitude happened. Ah, you can see it happen, actually, if you look at the damage. Because it said minus 12, and then it said plus 1 right after it. Yeah. I guess it's like plus 1 hit point or something. Well, shit. You want to be right next to this guy? No, I don't. I'm... Oh, shit. <laughs> he just tried to punch me. I like that he... they have punch animations. <laughs> like, yeah. for if they lose their oh, weapon. Oh, lose his weapon, you're right. He still has all the, a lot of orbs on him, too. He's going to miss. I mean, the only scary thing about him now is his stupid reflux shit. Yep. He's glowing through. Yeah. I don't think I can save you, Woodwode. You're... Ooh. Oh, he's immune to burning. I guess he can take fire damage but not be set on fire. Okay. Alright, what if I put the entangle over here, Woodbode, and if you survive, you can run that way. How about that? <laughs> and it's on fire. God oh, damn no! it! All <laughs> the hell! Alright, give up! You're done, Woodbode! I can't I'm save just you! Spreading fire I don't everything. understand! There was no fire over there! Still on my feet. No! It's just a spark jump from one fire to another. Alright, am I actually close enough? I am! Zap! Alright, well, I'm doing yeah, 20... Yeah, 140 hit. I know, I'm doing like 20 some damage a turn. And it doesn't cost a spell slot because I'm just concentrating on it, but it's still going to take a fucking while. Now he's burning. Here it comes! <laughs> oh! Woodboat Leave do, me alone! Do not. Woodboat can't hurt him anyway. Right. He really. No! Oh god! On Stoli! No! Oh. It didn't kill you though! It just did 11. Okay. Thank god for that shield. So Jesus. He doesn't feel good. He'd be blacked out. He is overindulged in his own brew. He has a minus five to armor class and is vulnerable to slashing, piercing, bludgeoning, and thunder. Okay. Get in there and start hitting him. He has Damn lost that, all. Hurt him. <laughs> <laughs> He's vulnerable to everything. Jesus. Okay. Oh my think? gosh. All right. What do we got? That lasts. This, this is one of those fights that you're just supposed to survive long enough, and then and then so. it just it just gives it to you at the end. Woodboat, if you're gonna survive. Oh. No! <laughs> he died. Now I am really tempted to go up and do vampiric touch on him. Just do it. Do all He's the things to him. Yeah. Thunder, radiant, and force are doubled. Yeah. Oh, oh also, okay, yeah. So, yeah, it's, yeah, all the- Thunder, yeah. radiant, force, and all the main ones, yeah. All, you know, the physicals, yeah. Do we have, so magic missile would do double damage. I wonder how long he stays blacked out. I don't know. It doesn't have a turn thing on there. It does not. <laughs> we need to do as much damage as possible this round. Yep. Yep. God, just a fucking mm. field of fire around him. I don't know what to do. So thunder <laughs> is Can double. Can you do any of those damage? To yeah. Oh, gonna do shatter. There you go. At a third level. There you go. Oh damn! I'm gonna break, I'm gonna break all the shit. <laughs> oh wow. shit! 38. 38. That's good. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. <laughs> yeah, really, goodbye, goodbye. really doesn't doesn't like you. Yep. I'm gonna like, run out of my health potions. Right. Took heals. Alright, All right, time to hit him as much as I can. Oh shit! Whoa. Oh shit! Did you just kill him? Yes. Yeah, did you do a hundred damage? Well, me and Ray. Ray, uh, Ray blasts him with some bullets oh, yeah, at the same time. Yeah. I'm not even sure. Holy, I gotta scroll up. What the fuck was that? Rumbeer like, used main attack, open. was hit for 30 slashing, and then 40 slashing. Wow. Because he was, uh, vulnerable? Well, you did, you did, crit you did a also. crit. Oh, I crit, and then it doubled that crit. Yes. So because of his crit. vulnerability. Yeah. Jesus. Wait, attack And then Ray, Ray hit him for 32 right before that. Wow. I was thinking, can we do this much damage in a, in a, before he wakes up? But 
You guys need yes, me to do it. Yeah. We can. That's bonkers. All right, you fat What bastard. an interesting <laughs> boss yeah, fight. I'll right. say that. Oh, he just has like herbs and <laughs> herbs and alcohol. Oh, Jesus. Well, we all leveled up from that fight. He oh, had a sure key did. as well too that I picked up. Oh, okay. Well, that key better be what we need to do this shit, because Jesus Right. Christ. All right, uh, do we want a short rest or a long rest here? Uh, we have short I rest. I use the key. I'll do it. Do it. Yeah, throw a short rest. Uh, sorry, where is the key? Where are you? I used it back here. Okay. Yeah, a rat throw. bat. Wait, quick save, quick save. Oh, yeah, yeah. What does this rat bat do? I think that was my first boss fight without me shifting. Yeah, without you Achievement being. unlocked. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Wait, why am I upstairs? Oh, this takes you back outside. Oh, uh, okay. That, that, the room that well, was locked was the door outside? Well, somewhere in the circle is a ledger we need to find. Uh, Where, I don't know. Well, should somebody look at the quest? Let's see. You know we need some stairs. Is, what's the quest called? Uh, what is it called? Yep, Punish the Wicked, yeah. He who was wants to bring justice to the victims of a murderer. To do so, he needs a ledger belonging to the killer. It is hidden in the waning moon. That's all it says. So I just failed a perception check over here. Someone needs to come up. Someone else needs to come over where I am. There's some kind of a perception check thing going. That might be worth a look. Gotcha. Loose planks. Right in front of you. Found a ledger! Okay. There you go, Madeline's Ledger. 35 experience, Punish the Wicked is updated. That was easy. Would you like to read it for the class? Uh, it's long. Okay. Oh, yeah. The words for the attention of Dark Justice Seer Natasha are written across the top of every page. This is an excerpt from the last page. Morning, day 15, Seisman Nowak said Kethrick wouldn't hold on to Moonrise Towers for long at this rate. Evening, day 18, Imani Atakani claimed it was just unfair that the Thorms had the cushiest jobs. <laughs> Night, day 22, Mark Jacobs, that's a nice designer, uh, Benjamin Blanchett <laughs> made jokes about the Thorms, especially Lord Kethrick, said he was a misery guts, a weeping nutsack. <laughs> And discussed exactly how his wife would have liked it. Mm. Oh my. I know what Mark and Ben said was just plain awful, Lady Natasha. But there's some of my best friends that I've never heard such talk out of them. They were upset over their wages being cut and were the drunkest I'd ever seen by midnight. I know it looks bad. But hand over heart, you've never met two gents more devoted to Our Lady. I swear it. A different, more elegant script appears beneath. Our Lady of Loss would be proud of you, Madeline. Do not worry about Mark and Benjamin. Myself and your two gents are simply going to have a little chat, I promise. Huh. Oh, the the night goddess took the two gents for being naughty. Yeah. We're talking shit about the thorns. Yeah, so yeah. she kinda of, she kinda of turned them in, but she didn't think that anything bad was gonna happen when she turned them in. This is all very like like huh. More Nazi night. Poland type stuff. Yeah, like. <laughs> more night, more naive than like uh, yes, uh, like sinister though. Malicious, Malicious exactly. Yeah. You, yeah, yeah. <sighs> like she was being pressed to listen and turn in people who were talking shit. Hmm. Gladiatorial sand sandals. Yeah, there's, can you, I noticed you could click on, like, the giant distillery thing. Is there something to be had with that? Down there? Uh, where is it at? What distillery I thing? you could click on it. Oh, maybe you can't now. My bad. I thought maybe this was interactable over here. Oh, uh, maybe it was something we could do before we fought the guy? Yeah, I don't know. I, yeah, it looked like there was a gear icon when I hovered over it, but now there's not, so... You're right, maybe it was a boss thing. Probably like the one... I'm sure somebody will comment on the video, like that one boss fight we had with the Fire Forge. They're like, you could have pulverized it in the thing. Oh, right, yes. Well, we We're didn't We're sitting here that. struggling, and they're like, if you just push the thing on the thing... Like, I don't know, man. 
I mean, it's a good idea. It's just like, yeah, we, just, we didn't think of it in the, in the moment. Sorry. <laughs> you get our raw takes on everything. I, exactly. I do no research, no... So, do we level up, up now? Should we, should we... Uh, oh yeah, you can do that whenever, right? Yeah. Yeah, I guess we could all level up here. It's a quiet moment. God, what are we, level 8 now? We're level 8. Going to 8? Alright, yeah, let's do a level up. Okay, now I get the thing I was talking Well, I guess it wouldn't actually help me from Entangle, but all I get is uh, my health goes up and I get land stride, where difficult terrain no longer slows me down. Uh, I also get a feat. I'm not feet. sure what I'm going to take for the feat. Oh boy, I can now shape into a saber toothed tiger. What? Is it better than Albert? I don't know. Albert's pretty great. Uh, it says it can shred armor and regenerate hit points. Oh, okay. They sound like good things. Albert is so good, though. Albert is really good. Uh, Super Tiger is a starting health of 62 hit points. It increases every true druid level. That's about the same as the Albert. Yeah. Albert has the AoE, is the thing, so I wonder. Maybe if I don't need the AoE. Right. I also get a fourth level spell slot, and yeah, new feat. I also get a fourth level spell slot. Yeah. Nice. Nice. So, Ray, are you Wall still... Wall of fire. That sounds fun. <laughs> but, uh, since you're the multi-class, are you still going Bard or Warlock? I don't know right now. I'm looking at the two options. Oh, I have no idea what to do with feet. Shit. I think I might take Banishment. Temporarily banish your target to another plane of existence for two turns. That could be useful. Yeah, I think it does require concentration. <laughs> so that you do that on a tough guy and then you run and hide because the AI in this game is so fucking good at knocking you out. Concentration. Ooh, confusion is good too because it's a multi target. How do I know which uh, ones I have proficiency in? I'm going to take confusion. That's a good one. That is a good one. Intelligence. And yeah, that one, and that one in this game I've seen work amazing. Like, people attack each other and all sorts of crazy shit. Mm. Let's see. Mm, I bet mobile's pretty good for my form. Oh, yeah. Your movement speed increases. Difficult terrain doesn't slow you down when you dash. And if you move after... And it's a move after making a melee attack, you don't provoke opportunity attacks. It's probably the best thing for me to take. Oh, Jesus. Oh, they have Lucky in this game, though? Lucky is so good. That's such a good feat. <laughs> yeah, I think I want mobile. Creeps three meters. Great opportunity attack. Very difficult terrain. So then I get resilient with con. Although I do have a base 15 con, so if I get a plus one to con, that's a lot more hit points. And proficiency in constitution saving throws, which would give me a pretty damn good con save. Hmm. We're only going to get one more feat in this game, right? I think it ends at like 12. <laughs> uh, yeah, it ends at 12. Yeah, yeah. So I think, yeah, there's, there's going to be one more feat. Yeah. What ends at 12? Oh. This game. 12 level? Is the max level, yeah. Oh. What? Like every 5e campaign. <laughs> right. So even if you don't finish the game, you're just stuck at 12? Well, I think 
There just, it does no going past 12. Yeah, it caps you there no matter what. Mm. Which feat did you take on? Well, I'm torn between three of them. <laughs> oh, boy. So there's Warcaster, which is always good. Con you get a sa advantage mm. on saving throws to maintain concentration. Yeah. That's always good. And as a reaction, I can cast Shocking Grasp, but targets moving out of melee range for me. Hey, yeah. And then there's Spell Sniper, which I can learn a ca an extra cantrip. And then the number I need to roll a critical hit is reduced by one. So that that's pretty good. Yeah. And then there's Ritual Caster, which I can learn two ritual spells of my choice. Hmm. Uh, I feel like I need a list of what those are. Right, yeah. yeah. I'm going to have to Google that real what quick. What ritual spells are in Baldur's Gate 3? Well, it's like my uh, Long Strider, uh, Speak with Animals, yes. Speak with Dead, like all the stuff that you can just turn on as a permabuff kind of familiar is probably right. one they generally seem pretty low level but also fairly useful that's tough i i mean i don't like any of those i'm not gonna go ritual caster i would probably right. vote well, war caster and I'm, I'm torn now between that and spell sniper yeah I guess it depends on how, how often you're throwing cantrips versus how often you're concentrating on a spell. I mean, it and just wh depends. What's your con save? Uh, my con is, right now is at 16, so that's like, what, a plus 3? Uh, yeah, yeah, plus 3. Advantage is pretty good, but... Yeah, Spell Sniper gives you another cantrip, and then you roll, you get a crit on a 19 or 20. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's if, well, if that you, seems good. Well, it's assuming a lot of the spells you're using are, are attack rolls. Most of them are, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's true. It's not just yeah. I didn't read that. You're right. The number you need to roll with a critical with any spell is boost by one. Yeah. Which yeah, I mean, I've it's... got like fireball. I've got magic missile. Doesn't count because that's just an auto hit. Sure. A uh, shatter. None, all of, the, of, those none of those can crit are... though because they're not um, attack rolls. Which ones are? Fire, yeah, firebolt. Fireball. Fireball's not. It's a save. Anything that is a save would not. This would not apply to. Oh, most of my shit saves then. Right. So it's only one right. with attack rolls, which not even magic missile is either, because there's no attack roll there. It'd be like attack uh, rolls. I I can't remember any other. Ray, like, Ray of Frost. Yeah. Chill uh, touch. Scor Scorching ray. Scorching ray is a yeah, good one. Yeah, those are the ones I don't use. I don't think I even have. Acid arrow. Uh, yeah, which which bolt? Which bolt is an attack roll? Which bolt's an attack roll? Yeah. But see, I don't have that as an actual spell. You'd be using that from a, a scroll. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you're not okay. using a lot of attack rolls, then I don't think Spell Sniper is worth it for yeah. you. If you're using concentration stuff at all, I think Warp Caster's pretty money. But uh, the AI is also just really good at uh, fucking attacking people with concentration, so. Yeah. I'm also tempted to get the ability improvement and just up my charisma by two, so I have a 20 for charisma. A natural 20 for charisma. Oh, I forgot you could do that. That's right. You scroll at the top. <laughs> mm -hmm. I know. I'm torn between mobile and just upping my con by one. Because uh, that'll get from a 15 to a 16. Yeah, I'm I'm torn on the feet. I hate this. Yeah, the feet's such a big <laughs> one. <laughs> I'm going to go to the bathroom while you decide. Yeah. Oh, did you look at durable? Uh, which one is that? Durable. Constitution increased by one. And you regain full hit points each time you take a short rest. Oh, yeah. That would be a good one. Well, there's also tough, which is just straight up more hit points. You get an additional two hit points for every level, which right now would be an additional 16 hit points. <laughs> Humongous, yeah. Because it's retroactive. Oh, that's tempting. Yeah. I go down so fast. <laughs> I'm, I'm yeah. only going to have 58 hit points after this. Jeez. Well, I'm at 67. Honestly, I'm a stupid D8. I just have... The wild shapes keep me up more often than not. So many good uh, options. I know. Are y'all waiting for me? No, I'm still... What about still... you, Ray? What do you do? 
Who, me? Yeah. I was debating about the warlock, because I can get uh, packed to the boon and get like a little imp. I was going to say, do you even know which class you're going on next? <laughs> but I'm going bard because I have access to slow. I have that. And that's probably going to be a good one. And then I'm picking my next spell. But Would that be bard six for you then? Uh, yeah. Yeah. So more spells, more spell slots. And you, uh, you can cast bard spells with warlock spell slots, correct? Uh, yeah, but I only have two warlock spell slots. Right, but they come back on a short rest. Correct. Yeah. But yeah, the imp was tempting, but um. I think more spells. Yeah. Be useful. I think I'm gonna go mobile because I'm I'm wild shape nine percent of the time. That's gonna help me the most in wild shape form. Yeah, get around. Yeah. Being more con seems good, but it's only when I'm these rare this rare fight that I just had will be like the one opportunity where it's like, oh yeah, when me and Druid form most of the time. Mm-hmm. I don't know. So <laughs> let's go to my spell book. Oh shit! I got all these new slots, I guess, because I up my wisdom from the thing. Oh, all oh, right. <laughs> Which will go away when you lose the yeah wisdom. Betrayal of the putrefied tumor. What? Who's, uh, who's unlocking recipes? Or no, I don't oh, have... I am, I am. I'm, I'm in the potion thing. Have... Spells I can memorize. That's what went up. I can also gain proficiency in three skills of my choice. <laughs> How do I know what I'm proficient at? Uh, uh, I can tell you. Yeah. You're proficient in sleight of hand, arcana, deception, and persuasion. Proficiency bonus with a plus three to things. Uh, it's I don't know. I mean, between the four of us and being able to like divvy it up, it doesn't seem like we're ever like, oh no, we don't have a this. Mm. Alright, I'm gonna go Warcaster. Advantage on saving throws to maintain concentration on a spell. That's pretty good. Yeah. I don't know what it, the math adds up to be, but it's like having a plus whatever to that save for having advantage. Low open, it doesn't heal you fully. That's some bullshit. Hmm. Oh, apparently, druids get wall of fire. That seems unthematic. <laughs> <laughs> There's a whole new subclass for him now the wildfire druid. That's an excellent point. Ooh, my spell safety DC went up. Nice. That's always good. I have a plus 12 to melee and ranged spell attacks. Level 8. How the hell do we get back to that one guy? I don't even know where he was. Is he on the map? What guy? Oh, he's on the map. Okay. Uh, punish the wicked. Oh, right. Is yeah, there? the guy way the hell back there. Yeah. There's a waypoint that's semi near him. Uh, was there anything else we need to explore around here? I don't know if there even is anything farther to the west. Yeah. So we can go look, but certainly no, like, points that I can see. Yeah. Like the 
Looks like it looks like a, the actual like distiller background place. There's some poison back here. Drow poison. There's a chest. Looks like poison resistance. Be wary. This some more lootables. A trapped gate. Trapped gate. They. There's some good shit in there. And so you would just not want to play this game without somebody that can pick locks. Right. It's almost required, I almost think. Required. Yeah. That would just be too frustrating to pass all that there shit up. There is a two-handed great club called Punch Drunk Bastard. <laughs> Wait, why are you... We search I don't know. Okay, I, 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 just, book? I clicked a book. A rare purple worm. Distiller Thizzable Thorn sought to create a fatal poison using the worm's gullet. He procured several parts of a worm gullet, but sure. rinsed one in error. The poison he brewed was noxious, but not fatal. Visible devoted months okay. to formulating a deadly poison with the remaining ingredients. Without Why was he success. trying to make a poison? He was a fucking... After exhausting right? experimentation, he was able to make a near-deadly extract from the glands. But to complete his poison, Thizzabald so... required one last ingredient. The petals of a corpse rose. The book's index reveals corpse roses may grow near tombs, mausoleums, and particularly redolent okay, cadavers. Chris, you would, you would know how to pronounce it right there. A courier from Baldur's <laughs> Gate to obtain corpse rose petals and other ingredients and deliver them to a co- Oh, this is a cutscene. It's just the narrator yeah, reading the book is... to us. <laughs> what a weird choice. Like, all the others have just been books that you book. read. Yeah. Destination. Yeah. Oh shit! Okay, well, I could investigate for a minus one, or I could just walk away. <laughs> I'll try it. Might as well. Might as well try it. I'm here. And I mess up a very good this is what happens in how I got a freaking book attached I to can, my soul. I can give you yep. some guidance. Give me some think, guidance. I'm probably gonna need it. I don't think I'm concentrating anything. Uh, can you give me a plus three? Oh, oh but my minus one! Oh no! Minus one. Do I try it again or do I just let go? Uh, my odds aren't great. You've got, I don't know if any of us other ones can read it or not. Intelligence is our Achilles heel with this group, unfortunately. Okay, I'm trying. I'll try. I'll try. I'm gonna try. Yeah, our, our best is a plus two. Okay, yeah. There you go. That'll do it. That'll <laughs> do it. I think the intelligence also comes up the least amount. I think. The right. line separates the black from yeah. the blue, revealing the stash's location. Why are you smoking? You mark your map <laughs> as a reminder. Like legit, your head is like smoking. The package it, oh, I don't know. So it might create Thizzabald's purple worm okay. poison. We, we need a side quest oh, okay. out of this. Yeah, okay. We'll pick up a package and then you can make Thizzabald's purple poison. What is that? I think it's the covert critical thing. When I'm obscure, when I'm in darkness, my critical hit needs needs one less. Who's got a good uh, survival check? Uh, survival. I have a plus yeah. nine. I need a sixteen, oh, and go. I rolled a five. Wait, yeah. that, must, that must be boosted because I'm the uh, what you call it. It's got to be your wisdom. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you I failed. failed. I rolled a three. Shit. Oh boy. All right. Well, let me see if I can, let me see what I can do. Listen to this weapon. While you are drunk, nope. While you are drunk, you have advantage on attack rolls. <laughs> you also create a blast with each attack, dealing one to four thunder damage for ten feet. Wow. While you're drunk. I, I guess you can just drink uh, alcohol. <laughs> None of us have done that in this game. <laughs> Because they don't confer any effects other than maybe getting you drunk. Okay. I'm really annoyed with myself that I failed that. Yeah. With your my plus huge nine. Score. Yeah. Jeez. There's no way to redo it. Yeah. Well, I'll send Ray up there. See if he can do it. Yeah. Nobody picked up the elixir of poison resistance here. I don't. Already got resistance. There's a, right next to the chest. Right there. Yeah. Why not? You already got it. I, I, I've body. Already or your dwarf, dwarf body. I'm a dwarf. Yeah, I don't need. Yep. That. Where's the survival check? Uh, up here. It's a 
DC 16. I should have guidance you first. I just thought about that. I failed. Yeah, we all failed. <laughs> Not good. Nobody can uh, oh, land the that. The stash is somewhere side. we have not been before. It is north of us. Yeah. Okay. So maybe we want to go. Oh, it is. Make yeah. His, some. Make us. Yeah. Out. So we've got. So right now we've got that. But we also do can go back and talk to that wicked dude, whatever whatever his name is. He who was. Yeah. Maybe we should. Let's do. Let's see what time is it. Oh, yeah, it's pretty late. Oh, look, I just found the chest just by digging randomly. <laughs> oh, I forgot you could fucking do that. God damn. Me too, yeah. We're all like, oh, well. Oh, just, well, we uh, lost it. It's just got uh, some alchemy stuff and some gold. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Such a hard save for just yeah. some generic stuff. Yeah, do we need to... Probably uh, end things here. Yeah, it's a safe place. Yeah, safe place. and then next time we can go up and get that stash and then go and turn in the he who was the thing. Yeah. And then I don't think we have anything left except for Moonrise, so. I know. Yeah. I'm going to write that's... a sticky note so we know what we're doing next time. Right, yeah. I mean, the map should be. Yeah, I think. The map or... is not going to tell us. <laughs> <laughs> we need to complete more quests next time. All right, real quick save on there, and yeah, we made a level up and defeated. That was our only, or we had two fights, I guess, the shadows, and then right, yeah, an actual fun boss fight that we couldn't talk our way so couldn't talk our way. Right, out. yeah, we talked our way out of one of them, and then we didn't talk our way out of the other. Yeah, <laughs> going back and looking at it, apparently you could have talked your way out of it. Really, the brewer? Mm -hmm. I guess if you well, he, drank, he, just, he wanted you to drink, right? Yeah, yeah, yep. Oh, you know what? I actually, I did talk my way out of this. Was it making this, like con saves fight. and shit? Mm-hmm. Uh, you have to just talk to him and then be quippy with him. Huh. So yeah, my super charisma would have been great for that. Oh, man. Oh, well. We've talked ourselves out in a fight. It's good to have a good fight occasionally. Alright, that'll do it for now, then.